Hello and welcome to Kimberly's Kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make penne chicken alfredo. You will need the following ingredients. Four boneless skinless chicken breasts cut into small strips. One shallot finely chopped. Two cloves of garlic minced. Two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. Twelve ounces of gluten-free penne pasta. Two to three tablespoons of butter half a cup of heavy 35 percent cream half a cup of parmesan cheese two tablespoons of fresh basil chopped and salt and pepper to taste you will need the following tools a cutting board a sharp knife a skillet a large saucepan measuring cups and spoons a colander and a wooden spoon Heat the oil in the skillet over medium-low heat for about 30 seconds. Add the shallots and saute for two minutes, stirring constantly. Add the garlic and saute for another 30 seconds, stirring constantly once again. Add the chicken strips and saute until the chicken is fully cooked, stirring it occasionally. In the meantime, cook the pasta according to the directions on the package. Remember to stir the pasta occasionally as gluten-free pasta tends to stick to the bottom of the pan. Once cooked, drain the pasta and rinse with warm water. Drain once again. Don't forget to occasionally stir the chicken. You know the chicken is cooked through when it is no longer pink inside. Return the pasta to the saucepan Add the butter and stir until evenly coated. Add the cream and mix gently. Add the Parmesan cheese. Add salt and pepper to taste. Add the pre-cooked chicken. Add the fresh basil and toss the pasta gently. If the pasta seems dry, add more cream. For a vegetarian variation, I often replace the chicken with steamed broccoli or asparagus. And for special occasions, I simply use fresh seafood instead of chicken. And that's how I make penne chicken alfredo. Enjoy! A special thanks to Studio Zaro for use of their kitchen showroom to film this recipe.